Previously on Lukey at the Links, Bartley Kavanaugh, the front nine. So your boy is starting the back nine kind of on a weird way. I hit a crushing drive and then bogeyed the last hole in the ninth. And you can tell that was kind of not what I wanted to do with that reaction. I got away with it because you can miss out to the right on this golf course, but it was definitely not what I was hoping for. And then I hit this shot right here. Kind of the same as a lot of the holes, but it's beautifully designed. And if you can see me way over there, I'm hitting one of these typical third shot wedge shots to try to figure out what I'm doing with my life. My man Jesus kind of missed his ball into a pond. I was scurrying around. We're both trying just to get a good pace going because as you see the sun in the background, we're trying to finish all 18 holes and we start at 430. And that didn't even have a chance to go in. So that's the bogey. 11th hole, a lot more dynamic, tighter fairway, uh, hazard to the right, just elements of danger on this shot. Got out pretty good. We had a dynamic zoom in that. That's pretty cool that we did such a thing like that. And we're getting going on this hole. So that's, once again, you know how I feel when I got a wood in my hand. Pump it out there. Feel pretty good about the shot. You got the little Lukey lean. And we're advancing the ball a bit. So that is where my eagle shot is from. And the green, as you can tell, is well protected. And, yeah, that's... That's how it is. I'm really standing over this putt to really try to try to give myself a good look at it. I really want to give myself a good look. I'm trying to be Ben Crenshaw, and your boy had an eagle putt, and he totally messed it up. Good shot, but I made my putt. Jesus didn't film it, but he has no shoes on, so it's not a big deal. So 12th hole, one of the signature holes again, water involved in the hole. Terrible swing by Uncle Lukey, but I got away with it. I snuck over to the left-hand side. And then the greens have been slow on me all day, and then I hit a hard putt that, thankfully, I'm not at TPC Sawgrass, and I three-putted that hole. Really not a good feeling on a par three. So we're going back to the hole that you had just seen. I always take driver, and I was able to move it left to right and not put it into the water hazard. I was very confident. And I left myself with this shot. And I gotta say, this is another one where I criticize myself because I really should have just made this. I put myself in a scoring position and I just didn't capitalize. I went too far. We got a birdie putt. And this is really bad because it's like, okay, I ran it by. Can't, that's not a gimme. And you already know what's coming when you do this type of dumb stuff. Let's run it by on the low side the other way. So that's a three putt after getting on the green. Really not a good feeling. Next hole is we're kind of going into the, the heart of the course. Fuck, dude. I didn't push record. So I smashed this one. Really long drive. Well, I bombed it because it was downwind. And I only had about 100 yards in or maybe even less. And I was able just to have a number that I liked. My gap wedge is one of my favorite clubs in the bag. Had the gap wedge in my hand. Didn't know where it went, but this is unique where there's a lot of water behind. And I actually got lucky that I didn't take another club and fly it over into that. And once again, we're putting into these greens. I'm just not feeling confident with how I'm putting. But I made a good stroke and we took the par. And that was filmed in slow-mo. That's why that looked awful. And here we go on this hole. We're going, this is a left to right hole. Probably one of the more difficult holes because it's a longer hole. And you're also having to shape the shot. I hit it to the cart path. Then I had, some, I think it was the my ping three hybrid I was hitting. And I put it right into the bunker. So I had this buried lie. Fought it out of there. And I was really happy with that result. Even though that's not the best result that was a really really hard lie hit my putt to there took my bogey and we'll get going come on Jesus man I was trying to get you on there
So the home stretch of holes 16, 17, 18 are probably what they pride themselves on at this course. And the 16th hole is really a lovely hole. It's similar to a lot of other holes here, but it has danger all amongst the left-hand side. I love holes like that, even though I miss to the left at times. I love being able to miss to the right more. Once again, I had a wedge, good number, and I put it pin high right in there. I totally knew this was going to be a good hole for me. Yeah, a little past pin high, but that was a really, really good approach. I'm going for my second birdie. I'm trying to make a third birdie of the round, which would be terrific for me. I'm tired of coming up short, and I just run it by the hole. And that's really, really annoying. It was a trend that happened. I made that comebacker, but really annoying. And then my man Jesus had this for par. I got him a dynamic angle. The sun is setting. I'm like, let's get this and. This is what Jesus does with his spot on the vlog. Oh, it was a straight putt, but that was a great effort by Jesus. So this is the signature 17th hole at this course. It's the island green. It's a replica of the TPC Sawgrass hole. And me and Jesus decided to play a game here where it would be me and him playing this hole out, like closest to pin. But considering the limited amount of light, it all went to chaos very quickly. I was looking forward my whole round hitting this shot, and then I tried to muscle a 56 degree wedge into this hole, which I'm not sure why I did it, but I'm just thankful I did do it. Um, barely got it over, definitely was the wrong club, and then here's my man Jesus. We're both playing the hole, and why did you do this, Jesus? He took more dirt than ball, and you know when you hit a water shot, that's not good. So... TPC Sawgrass rules. We got to have him play from the front tees to hit his next shot. That's the drop zone is the front tees like it's Sawgrass. Money shot. He takes a nice good whack at it. Puts it up there. Really a great effort. And we didn't even film our putts. I made a par and all that. But we were kind of rushing through that hole. I told Jesus let's film it. And it just got messed up. But that's how that hole went. This hole was terrific. A replica of the TPC Sawgrass 18. I missed mine into another fairway, and this is one of the best shots I've ever hit in my life. I've got about 240 other fairway, playing with some guy I don't even know, and the ball, I hit a three wood with a draw, and I just moved this guy. We joined up with someone else. This is where I hit that shot, too. The boom, and I'll let you know after I hit these putts. And I two-putted that and made par, and that was my round. So that was my take on this course. I hope that you like, comment, and subscribe. And please be sure to check out for upcoming videos.